Hey, 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 you guys, Kalina here. Welcome to my channel. We are in my bedroom. I really wanted to record this video in my kitchen today because we're gonna be talking about food. Uh, besides song requests, the second type of question that I've asked the most is what I eat, but my kids are playing in the living room and it's gonna be really noisy. Uh, so I just wanna share what I have been um, doing for the last year. If you don't know, about three years ago, I started to cut meat off of my diet. I still eat fish, so I'm considering myself a pescetarian. Uh, whenever I feel like I wanna have meat, I do, but I must say 95% uh, of the time, I do not eat any chicken, any red meat, um, and that has made me feel much better um, and also has helped me to stay in shape and feel good. Not only like the weight, but just like feel good about myself and how my body functions. Um, I am gonna be telling you a little bit about Hungry Root, which is a food delivery service. This video is not a sponsored. I have been paying for the services for the last year. And if at the end of this video, it decided to try Hungry Root, I do have a code and a link. Uh, you can use either or, and you get $50 off your first box, and I get $50 credit for my next box. So it's a win-win, and again, this is not sponsored. It's my honest review. Uh, they have a huge, amazing, tasty, and not necessarily spicy, a variety of recipes that range from uh, vegan, vegetarian, and pescetarian. Um, if you are a meat eater or if you have somebody that is a meat eater in your house, uh, which it would be our family case, I sometimes just would buy like chicken on the side and I would just serve with whatever I am making from Hungry Root. Another differential with their uh, food delivery service is that it's not only meals, um, but they also have breakfast options, they have snack options, and just like regular fresh produce that you can order um, every week. So like I mentioned before, I started using Hungry Root about a year ago, uh, and that was part of my New Year's resolution, try to eat more vegetables and fresh meals, you know. And for that reason, I made so many random little videos, um, thinking about sharing this with you guys at some point. One of the videos I actually recorded right after I got back from the pool with the kids, so I'm like, oh messy, don't, don't mind my looks. And the second one, is of me making a recipe and that was right before Christmas. So there's a wine ad advent calendar um, on the counter. Don't mind that. <laughs> um, and that's it. So let's watch them so you can understand a little better what I am talking about. Um, it is Sunday and I just got my Hungry Root delivery and I just wanna show you how it comes because I've tried a lot of uh, subscriptions because it just makes my life easier and this specific one it's the best that fits the best for our family needs and i'm gonna show you why so this is the box i literally just got it um all their foods you can get snacks meals breakfast um it you create your box and all their vegetables everything comes free chopped so there's no waste not waste but there's no time you're not wasting time chopping stuff so yep it comes like that. Um, actually, I'm excited because this week we are using the this Trini chickpea curry that I love. And look, it comes already packaged and cooked. And all their products are very clean ingredients-wise. Um, a lot of them are organic and um, they focus on plant protein. Uh, there's three options you can pick your menu based on vegetarian, vegan, or pescetarian diet. And you can, you know, customize the way you want. This is the first time I'm gonna have, uh, it's called the actual black burger with vegetables. Anyways, that's the box comes, but I just wanna show you how easy 
this is and for real all the recipes take uh, between like around like 10 15 minutes to put together i never tried this either but this is a five spice nuggets uh, it is also plant-based and i love also that they use a lot of different worldwide flavors so that one is chinese uh, with the burgers for this week we're gonna use let's see if i can get this here it's organic sprouted power buns um, another thing that I love is that everything I make, the kids eat because everything is super straightforward. I'm obsessed with these um, cookies that they sent. And I also picked this salted caramel dark chocolate for late night snacks for myself. What else? Well, oh, this is a really good one too. It's an egg and it comes with the seasoning. So that's another breakfast. What else do we have here? More burgers oh and these also another favorite i must get this almost every week these are little falafel uh bites and i make really good wraps with them i think that's it oh and these also became my favorite it's all these brands that sometimes you see or not in the food store and you don't know if it's good so you just don't try it and um you kind of get obsessed so this i'm loving this and again, plant-based, dairy-free, non-GMO, soy-free, plant protein, 18 grams of plant, plant protein. Not a one of these. I have company um, coming, so I just ordered extras, some sweet potato, and the seven grain bread. I'm sure there's like a recipe that takes them. So that's how everything comes already pre. And there's another bag. Oh, there it is. This is my produce. Cucumbers, always a baby cucumber is very easy. Some uh, green onions, salad, probably we're gonna use for the burgers. This is like, this is um, baby spinach. Already washed, ready to go. Some avocados and limes. And last but not least, blueberries. Um, so today I am going to make for lunch a tofu veggie uh, fried rice. The recipes come like this. And a food shopping list, what you got in the box on the other side. Really cute. This one is going to take um, 10 minutes to make. So here we go. Skillet. Olive oil. It asks for a little bit of water. I'm gonna open the brown rice quinoa blend. Warm it up. Totally normal day. Lily's here. She might call me in a second. Okay. I'm gonna break this and warm it up. Okay, so rice is good. I'm gonna divide into the bowl. Next step, um, heat one tablespoon of olive oil and salted vegetables. Vegetables come like this. All right, so I'm salting this for two minutes. I'm gonna add two tablespoons of water and then it's gonna cook for another two. So four minutes total for this. I'm gonna cover. Wait two minutes back to it the next ingredient that I'm gonna add is the tofu um, I've had this before many times um, with their recipes it's savory spice tofu bites they are so good I even like to eat them plain all right so my vegetables are done nice and bright beautiful and I'm gonna put my tofu bites and just warm them up. I think we're good. Ta-da! Okay, so I don't know about you, but it makes me happy when I know I'm eating something good and nutritious. And this for me, it's what it is. Isn't it cool? Super easy, right? Straightforward. Um, one cool thing that they did was at the end of last year, they sent an email saying, you know, like my 
like a sum of what I ate from Hungry Root and all the vegetables that I, ate, that I ate. And it was really, really neat to see. Also, their website is very easy to navigate. Um, once you decide how many meals per week you want them to send you, if you want snacks or breakfast or not, um, it's really easy to navigate. You can custom your profile. Like for instance, I don't like spicy food. So I already said like, no, no spicy food. And if you for some reason forget to edit your cart, you're still gonna get your box, but it's already tailored to you and you know, to your likings. So I don't know, I think it's really cool. I am planning on sticking with Hungry Root for a while. And you know, I'm just trying to stick with healthier eating habits, you know, make healthier choices for me and my family um for the years to come forever actually <laughs> okay guys thank you so much for watching i know this is a little different video but um i just wanted to share it with you because you asked me so there you go thank you so much i'll see you around bye